Jerry Barr, one of the more vocal people on Facebook, on social media, uh, talking about his Austin Steelers. The other big topic that everybody's been uh, kind of popping off, and it was a post made by uh, Brian Morgan on the Typhoon Radio uh, Facebook page. It was dealing with Friday Night Tights. And I've had a lot of these questions, well, asking if, you know, are, are, is Friday Night Tights coming for a fifth season? And he, he gave a great statement. I'll read the statement to you uh, so you, everybody hears the same thing that I'm talking about here. We have received several inquiries regarding the state status of Friday Night Tykes and whether or not there would be another season. As most of you know, NBC Universal shut down the Esquire Network before it aired this past January, which left the show in limbo as they determined what they would do with Friday Night Tykes. There has been no decision, and the producers are attempting to shop the show to other networks at the moment. Uh, we will not go into all of the specifics, but as now, there will be no Friday Night Tykes for the upcoming season. I know this saddens some of you, but with the show's popular popularity, we are sure that it will return. Now, let me give you my take on this. I hear this every year. Every single year, I hear this. Oh, they're not coming back. Oh, they might not be coming back. Now they might be back. I don't know. That's why when everybody asks me about it, is Typhoon doing Friday Night Tikes again this season? I don't know. I usually find out about a week before San Antonio certification. So I'm not expecting anything for a couple weeks. I guess the real big question is, do we want them back? Do we want to be back on Friday Night Tikes? Do we want that show to continue here with Typha? That's probably the biggest question that a lot of people would want to answer, want to talk about. Uh, we may bring that up maybe next Wednesday, make that a topic of discussion. We'll see. I'm not sure. Not quite sure how I feel about it. I'm a radio guy. Not much for my face being in the camera. Not sure. It's like I always tell people, this face right here was not made for camera. It was made for radio. So that's the status right now of Friday Night Tights. And again, you can read that post yourself. It was done on July 24th. Uh, here on the Typhoon Radio Facebook page, check it out. We also got all the list of the uh, uh, certification dates coming up. Uh, most of it says to be determined right now, uh, but at least you have the dates. Uh, contact your organizational president, athletic directors for more information. I can tell you, uh, let's see, we'll go through uh, the 19th. 19th, of course, San Antonio on Saturday is going to be the San Antonio Event Center. Uh, August 19th also is the RGV and also Austin once again. Uh, August 20th, that's Sunday, it's the RGV in Austin. On August 26th, they're going to be out in West Texas for certification. Also on the 26th, they'll be in DF DFW, Dallas-Fort Worth. They're going to be at the Crowley Rec Center, uh, 405 South Oak, Crowley, Texas. Um, August 27th, they'll be in West Texas in the Rio Grande Valley once again. And also in DFW at the same location, Crowley Rec Center. And then August 27th, it's the one makeup day, I believe, for San Antonio or anybody else uh, that didn't make it. It's going to be at John Paul Stevens High School at uh, 600 North Ellison Drive in San Antonio. Certifica certification is here. Season is upon us. Again, September 2nd is the first weekend of the regular season. We are one month away from the first games of the regular season. Our you ready is all I can say. I know I am. 
Hey, don't forget, Ty for Radio Player of the Game Award. Uh, we're still looking for some sponsors uh, for the Ty for Radio Player Game Award. If you're interested in being a sponsor uh, for the Ty for Radio Player of the Game Award, give me an, shoot me an email at Kenny, K-E-N-N-I-E dot long at Typha dot com. That's Kenny dot long at Typha dot com. Uh, we'll give you some information on what you can do to be a sponsor of the Typha Radio Player of the Game Award. Looking for multiple sponsors for this award. It's a great award. Uh, we've had fun for the last two years giving this award. Uh, the kids love it. Uh, we go out there wherever we are doing game day. Wherever I'm at doing game day, um, there will be a player of the game awarded. Now, I've had a lot of questions. Some people ask me, how do I choose uh, the player of the game award? Because this is my choice. I make the choice. Now, it could be the with the one player that just carried the team. He he could be the the, the, the star of the team. Who knows? Or it could be that one player that just did something that turned the fortune of that game. Whether it be a big catch, a big run, maybe it was a big defensive play. Maybe it was a hand stopping a pass into the end zone. Maybe it was a lineman making a big block on offense, maybe a big tackle on defense that stopped the momentum of the opposing team. So there's many different uh, aspects of how I choose uh, the player of the game award, but they get a great plaque, and they get their picture taken, and we post it all over social media. We post it on the Typha website. You can go to typha.com, check out the Typha radio page um, on that page, and you'll see all the pictures of the previous winners uh, from last season. And I believe the season before that, the two years we've done this award. Uh, This award is carried all through the regular season, and into the playoffs, other than the championship game, as we have the Al Hollins Player of the Game Award. So a lot of great things coming up here for the season. Time for Radio Player of the Game Award, of course, wherever we're at doing uh, during uh, game day. And speaking of game day, uh, let me give that information right now. Uh, if you are interested in Time for Radio coming out and doing game day on uh, one weekend of your home games, uh, shoot me an email at kenny.long at typha.com. That's K-E-N-N-I-E dot long, L-O-N-G, at typha.com. Uh, we'll send you the form and give you the information of what you need to do to book Typha Radio to come out to do game day here during this regular season. It's a great time. I love coming out, uh, whether it be San Antonio, Houston, uh, RGV, Dallas. Uh, of course, RGV in West Texas is a little bit different of a situation there with the distance, uh, but we'll give you that information, what we need to do to get that set up. Uh, so we can get out there and do those games. And, of course, give your players the chance to win the Typha Radio Player of the Game Award. We're going to step away real quick, take a quick break. We'll be right back here as we continue here on Typha Radio. You're listening to The Zone every Wednesday starting at 8 p.m. Joey Teague, son of Mike and Patty Teague and longtime Typha members, was born with cystic fibrosis. Despite this, Joey went to school, graduated with honors from Judson High School, and attended the University of Texas at San Antonio for three years, all while struggling to stay healthy. Joey also coached in Taifa with the Live Oak Jaguars from 1998 to 2006 and was a husband and father. Joey passed away in 2007. The Joey T. Taifa Volunteer of the Year Award was established to recognize and bring attention to the many volunteers who helped make Taifa one of the premier leagues in Texas and the nation through heartfelt passion, enthusiastic commitment, and a contagious spirit, all of which epitomized Joey T. and all that he gave to youth sports. For more information or to nominate a volunteer from your organization for the Joey Teague Type of Volunteer of the Year Award, send your nominee's name, contact information, and a short bio as to what makes them a great volunteer. You can send the information to helpdesk at typha.com. That's helpdesk at typha.com. The Joey Teague Type of Volunteer of the Year Award. Recognize your volunteer. Points, cash, gear, sports. With a Dick Scorecard, you earn points on all your purchases and get 3% back in rewards and access to exclusive deals and events. It's simple. Points lead to cash to buy gear so you can play more sports. Get your Dick Scorecard and start earning reward certificates today. Every season starts at Dick's. All-Star. All-Star. All-Star Inflatable, a premier custom manufacturer of cold air inflatables. And they know what.
what Big Time Texas Football is all about. They specialize in Team Spirit Tunnels, inflatable helmets, mascots, bounce houses, and much, much more. They also do repairs. No job is too big or too small for All-Star Inflatables. With over 35 years of combined experience, their goal is to create, design, and manufacture top quality inflatables at affordable prices. All-Star Inflatables is proud to manufacture 100% in Texas, 100% made in the USA. All-Star Inflatables is a proud sponsor of the Texas Youth Football and Cheer Association. Typha organizations, let them know you're with Typha and get 10% off. See their ad at typha.com and check them out at www.allstarinflatables.com. That's all-starinflatables.com. Or call their sales department at 888-349-4386. Or email them at sales at allstarinflatables.com. All Star Inflatables. If you can imagine it, they can inflate it. Hi, Kenny Long here, and I want to talk to you about rain gutters. With the recent heavy rains in South Texas, many of us have come to realize that the rain gutters on our homes either don't work or simply just don't exist, destroying flower beds and just creating a mess. Let me tell you about Curtis McCluskey with Advanced Rain Control. He is your go-to guy for seamless gutters, cleanouts, and repairs. Serving San Antonio and the surrounding areas with over 25 years experience, Curtis will get you a quality rain control gutter system on your home at a quality price. Contact Curtis at 210-863-9881 for your free quote today. That's 210-863-9881. Don't get caught in the rain without a quality gutter system on your home. From Advanced Rain Control, call Curtis today at 210-863-9881 and tell him Kenny Long sent you. GTM Sportswear. GTM Sportswear. Look like a team, train like a team. GTM Sportswear can outfit your entire team with custom jerseys, uniforms with amazing new sublimations to choose from, warm-ups, and much, much more. Get your team practice wear with up to 20% off. They even have great fan apparel for that team spirit look. GTM Sportswear is a proud sponsor of the Texas Youth Football and Cheer Association. Need uniforms for your cheerleaders? They got those too. Get some of the best prices on all apparel with their amazing partnership with Typha. Just go to gtmsportswear.com and get outfitted for the season. Once again, that's gtmsportswear.com. Or call Melanie Miller at 785-249-5343 for more information. GTM Sportswear. Love what you do, wear what you love. Monarch Trophy Studio in San Antonio, a leader in the awards and recognition industry since 1972. Their mission is to provide their customers with a wide variety of high quality, competitively priced awards. They have awards for sports, scholastics, employment, you name it, they've got it. Trophies, plaques, badges, pins, and much, much more. With the advancements in technology and the internet, Monarch Trophy Studio has quickly become one of the leading premier online award retailers. Monarch Trophy Studio is a proud sponsor of the Texas Youth Football and Cheer Association and proud provider of all TIFA awards, including the Dale Morgan Trophy. Visit Monarch Trophy Studio in their 30,000 square foot state-of-the-art production facility located at Highway 281 in Thousand Oaks in San Antonio, Texas. Contact them toll-free at 1-800-364-7903 or by email at sales at mtsawards.com. Check them out on their interactive website at www.mtsawards.com. That's mtsawards.com. Monarch Trophy Studio in San Antonio. Come get your trophy at Monarch Trophy. You're listening to Typha Radio, part of the Typha Sports Network. Welcome back to The Zone here on Typer Radio. Kenny Long, your host here. Every Wednesday, starting at 8 p.m., you can email me at kenny.long at typer.com. Kenny.long.typer.com. Follow me on Twitter at Kenny Long Radio or at Typer Radio. We got an Instagram page as well, Typer Radio. You can follow us on there. Check out some of the pictures. I post a lot of pictures during the season on that. Uh, the different games that we're at, the different kids, different players, volunteers doing what they do best, and that is providing some of the best youth football in the state of Texas. On the line with us right now is one of our new organizations who's joined us 
here for the 2017 fall season. It is from Irving, Texas, the Irving Seahawks.